Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Salam alaikum. Today we are going to learn how to install Gradle manually. I am your host HM Tohid Mia from HM Team CSE. Okay. For how to install Gradle manually, we will going to follow these uh, steps. It's created my website. Uh, I will put this link to the description so that you can visit this URL. Here, first thing first, that is, uh, before installation Gradle process, you have to prepare the Java environment because Gradle run with Java. That's why here, I also added some steps for how to configure your uh, Open JDK and other JDK here. Uh, you also find a video uh, for that tutorial. If you want, then you can follow this video, otherwise, uh, no need. Okay let's begin to step first thing uh, we have to download that gradle uh, binary file that's why i'm going to this uh, location this is the gradle release page here you are you will see a uh, lots of version uh, when i'm recording this video the latest version is 6.4 so i'm going to download that 6.4 uh, for that i am downloading this binary only section uh, i'm clicking on it uh, and it will uh, already uh, it will uh, start download but uh, for uh, sake of simplicity i am just uh, already downloaded that uh, uh, tool in my desktop uh, let me show you here this is gradle 6.4.6.4 uh, uh, bin okay now <coughs> we we have to uh, set that uh, environment variable before set environment variable we are going to copy this gradle uh, zip file into our c drive uh, let's uh, let's start i'm copying this one copy going to c drive then here i created one uh, directory for gradle because if i needed multiple gradle uh, then I can put that Gradle file here. I'm going to paste here. Paste. Then extracting this uh, 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 Gradle file using 7 zip. If you haven't 7 zip, then you can use that uh, uh, Windows Extract Here tool. For sake of simplicity, I'm just clicking on Extract Here using 7 zip. It extracted here. Uh, here you will see uh, three, four uh, file or directory. The first one is bin. This is the most important uh, directory for us. Okay, let's now uh, we have to add this bin file uh, to our environment variable. For that, I am uh, going to follow these uh, uh, steps. Okay, now I am going to start bar for here i am searching environment variable here two type of variable that is your account variable and the system variable if you have uh, limited access then you may choose that uh, your account variable uh, i got uh, administrative access that's why i'm clicking on and this uh, a, uh, environment variable for system okay and this is the properties okay now i'm going to going to uh, click on environment okay this is the environment from here uh, I have to go to uh, path path double clicking on here okay so in this path I have to add that uh, gradle path here uh, for that I'm clicking on new okay uh, before new I, I have to copy that bean directory this is the bean directory copying from here okay now I am adding that bin directory here. Okay, this way I added that uh, Gradle Gradle 6.4 dot bin here. Now going to OK, OK, then again OK, OK. Uh, this way we are successfully uh, completed the installation process. Now we are going to test this process. For that I am going to open open my CMD from start bar CMD okay cmd this is cmd now we have to write gradle version okay let's see is it uh, a find or not yes it uh, doing something let's see what happened here yeah it's uh, showing uh, some of thing the first thing is that Gra welcome to gradle 6.4 that means we successfully able to install the gradle in our windows system
thank you guys thanks for watching uh, the video please don't forget to subscribe my channel for future video